Good evening. School board members blast the director of schools. They say that Sean Joseph hasn't kept him in the loop about the $7 million in cuts coming to classrooms district wide. And there's more controversy over next year's budget as well. Basically, the question before the school board is whether some of Nashville's poor schools are about to take a really big hit. Tonight, before the public got their say, the school board members got their say. Now, some blasted the school's director about not telling them about this year's shortfall sooner. First, the board only recently learned that the district is facing a purported $7.5 million shortfall for the current school year. The administration learned about this problem in fall, but the board was not made aware of the amount of the shortfall or of any administrative plans to alleviate it. Metro School Director Sean Joseph's response to that, the school board members should have seen it coming, especially after he says he told them back in October there would be a 2,000 student, student, uh, student shortfall that would impact the budget. I'm okay with us um, communicating that we didn't know the $7.5 million number per se, um, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't just say that this should be a surprise to anyone, uh, particularly uh, members that have been on the board for years and know that this is, you know, you're, when you, you have a shortfall within a year, you, you got to make the, uh, the cuts. Tonight was the first chance for parents to let school leaders know how they feel about some controversial changes Joseph plans to make next year. In part, the administration wants to move federal money meant to help low income students to schools with the highest needs, and that means fewer low income students get access to that money. But those who do get it will get more. Between that and a projected drop in enrollment, some schools are looking at hundreds of thousands of dollars of cuts in the next year. How will anything in this budget convince more parents to send kids to our schools? Please know that the people in this room are committed to going to both city council and the state legislature to help you fight for the education funding Nashville's kids deserve. No decisions were made tonight, and the school board wants to schedule more public hearings about this budget before it's voted on. Next one will be held in two weeks, and of course, we'll keep you updated.